Hi guys, uh, my name is Daniel and this is CSS4 commands uh, number one um, and we are going to in this tutorials we're going to uh, see some commands of the uh, some features of the CSS4 uh, news new features CSS4 it's supported uh, in 38% of uh, in, in the in Chrome I don't know what's going on with uh, other browsers as far we gonna we're gonna use Chrome here and uh, let's begin showing you uh, some features the first feature we're gonna see it's a text put uh, I'm sorry and an input text that it's gonna change with when it's required or not required so let me make a uh, let's make a form here it's a simple form <coughs> with method of get and form okay we're going to to create two input input texts here with a type with a type of text input type equals text and sorry uh, we're gonna copy this and now what I'm gonna do here in the first input we're gonna change it to required uh, and I will explain you later what what this does. So required required equals equals quote unquote uh, required. Okay. Okay. Now I'm gonna go to style and. And change the require now the feature of the CSS4 is this we type uh, the required required uh, feature of the CSS4 with uh, these two dots and um, then inside that we can change anything we need to change on the element uh, of the input that it is required let's see that I'm gonna change the, uh, the border to one pixel solid and I'm gonna change the color actually because it's already one pixel and solid uh, the color would be red Okay, and let's see what we have done. Sorry for that. This is okay. As you can see here, uh, the the first one, first uh, input text, it's now red because it's required. You can see that it's the required, and we change it with this new feature of the CSS4. It's required and everything you do in that it will be changed only in the required fields uh, the cool thing about this is that we can change uh, not only the required but all the other uh, optional with this optional you can just type optional and change anything you need to change in your uh, optional uh, inputs so let's change the width here to 300 pixels and let's see now refresh it and it changes the width only in the one that it's required you cannot see that you cannot see that it's required but it is it uh, um, 
CSS4, CSS4 knows that it is required because you don't have it is optional because you don't have the the required on it so uh, for the first uh, for the first video uh, this is it thank you very much I will continue researcher researching and uh, I will explain you more from for the CSS4 commands and properties thank you see you in the next video